G'day and welcome back to Austrian Common Sense. So at this point I've pretty much decided to abandon this campaign in about an hour or so. So I think we'll go through to episode 50 and that'll do. Basically because we've done everything we wanted. We've got the achievements that we were looking for out of this one. We could do the other ones like the um, trade hegemon. We need Adan, Mogistan and Malacca. But I think I'd rather do that when I play as Spain. So we'll leave the other ones for another campaign. Basically, all I want to do at the moment is get revenge on Saxony for being bastards and taking our empire and making it hereditary. So we are fabricating a claim on Saxony as a reason to go to war. We're also, at the moment, waiting for Poland to agree to join in, which is basically just because of their debt. So we'll help them pay off their debt in a second. Alliance with... Well, since we're doing that, let's just accept some more alliances. Already pretty much way over our limit. That put us to... Oh no, we already had royal marriages with him. I think. Whatever. It's fine. And we'll just grab these ideas because we're ahead of time on admin and military. So that's good. Expiring Casus Belli against Mantua. No. So, going to war with Saxony. And actually, while well, we got the guy... Just go pay off their debt for them. I give them 500 should be enough. I know their debt was more than that, but I shouldn't have to pay it down the whole way to agree. Yep, Poland's in. In by a long way. Nuremberg and Nassau are going to get a bit of a drop in their rep soon. Ooh, actually, talking about prestige. We're going to have to go to war just to get our prestige back. Or we're going to lose the... We call it personal union with Hungary. How old are we? Only 38. Should have a while. Alright. Let's go for Spain. Even though I'd rather rival Saxony. Alright, so he's done. We will fabricate another one. What do we got? All right, let's go for his capital. And then next month we'll declare war. Making lots of money. It's all looking good. Lots of accepted cultures. Because of how crazy low it needs to be. 8%. Lombard's going down. Venetian's nearly high enough. So that's all we're waiting for. Let's go kill them. Let's watch the map turn red in the middle and green on the outside. Wow, I actually don't have that many allies. I thought they had more than that. Alright, double their men. Should be a short one. One's going to Bamberg, one's going to Saxony. Where's Bamberg? Oh, over there. Okay. Uh, I don't know what these guys are doing here. They have not yet reinforced. Fair enough. Ooh, chuck these guys up here to join them. We have three generals and we will have three armies. Johan, go there. He will walk right over there, right up there. These two will hang out at the back for a while. Definitely don't want that army to be fighting anyone, so I guess he is the best spot for him to wait. Maybe not. Yeah, let's get them moving in. Massive disadvantage there, but our guys heaps better. Poland's coming to help. Right. Benedict Schanzetta, five four. Alright, 
this guy now. He's going to head around back there. Just make sure everybody's ready to be attacked. We are 41,000 men down. 42 months away. We've got Fogland. I think we may as well go to... Uh, wait till that one falls and then we'll push forward. Or we'll stick these guys there. Others. France hasn't bothered to join in yet. Burgundy's got peasants. Tyrol's under attack again. Now France. Gonna kill them, I assume. We've got a free diplomat. That's right, Silesia. She gets some revenge on them as well. That did help us get an achievement, but von Katlenberg just isn't right. All right, lose money, lose prestige. Definitely not going to lose prestige. We've lost Lubeck. Guess that's why that just went down. Tax down at the moment is fine. Lots of money. Oh yeah, I forgot we took this. This taking this is the reason we lost the empire. The overextension from that, and then the immediate death afterwards. We have one Leipzig. Good. So I'd like to go start separate piecing people. Let's take a look. We did send them away, didn't we? Uh, I was going to annex Burgundy. That can wait. So, we need all of the prestige you've got, thanks. sucking thing anyway. I have nothing else at the moment. It's fine. Keep these guys together, get a bit of manpower back. There goes the capital. Guess what sounds so you gotta go. Who's the worst off? Probably these guys. under attack. Potsdam is ours. Head over to... That's no, not even... I thought that was stupid colours. Alright, head over that way. And I guess we'll go to Salzburg. These guys go in there. These guys will come down here. They'll probably get killed, but France is sort of nearby. Alright, go to second claim. And we were improving with Burgundy. Let's not forget that. Wow, hang on. His air is 60. 
69 and 60. It's going to be a bit of a battle. Let's just do some magic with these guys, make them feel a bit better about themselves. Zero to a nine. That's a lot better. Alright, one of our guys, or that one, will stay there. Let's come over this way. Go straight to burn, get started on that. Alright, admin. Administrative efficiency. Not really, but sure. Well, marriage with the platinum's over, I know. How will we cope? Let's go over to Kern. Saxony one out, not too bad. Saxony occupy Frygraph Shaft, that's just rude. Hungry killing Nassau. Hopefully. Should do. a lot of men. Started off double their men, a lot better than that now. No Saxony. Alright, what do we got? Keep working on our prestige, so war reps. Give up your claims. Null all these treaties. Come on. They're going to accept that. Got a claim on the Rattabore. Let's go fabricate on wherever, don't care. Cologne, that should fall in a second. Wow, France. Guess they just need a siege leader up there. Alright, super piece. War reps. Okay. Where else is their territory? Over there. Hiding it. Right, and they had 20 something war score. Made no sense, their whole country's done. I guess not. So, what is our chance of inheritance at the moment, anyway? 22%. Vestfalen are under attack. Too bad. Seriously? Okay. Guess Poland went over there for a bit of a wonder. Hey, Teutonic Order. Danzig is actually ours. Actually, yeah, we caught it from that. And you'll give us some money, and you'll give up your claims, and you'll give us. Well, we don't care about money. Well, it's fine. Alright, go away. My dad points, fair enough. France has taken our fortress back for us. Assume it's a fortress. No, it's a castle. Poland will crush that. Ready, go, splat. A lot of artillery there. Still not enough though. <laughs> Got plenty there, but just need to reinforce. 
Still losing men. He's still coming out every now and then. Help is a void. Leave that reminder there. Should be fine. What's our. Uh, have our extension, have a bit of war exhaustion, yeah, we can boost stability. They're only trying to separate because they're sieged. There goes Ben. Let's follow them over there. Hopefully they'll get in before us, just make sure they do. Jump in with France. We were here, we helped. Oh, I think we can, no, it's all artillery. Give it a go. Yeah, minus three. Game prestige. Game prestige. Attack some nobles. Hungry and fine should sort that out. Oh, we lost in Wallace. We lost most of our cannons. Not at all surprising. Send them to Munich, have a few drinks. Toberfest is over, but yeah. They can start another one. All right, we finally do Diplotech. What takes we up to actually? 21. Still trying to take that. It's our main army. It's a siege leader as well. As is that guy. So these guys. It's just a 3 1. Alright, there goes Clone. So, Clone. I think you'll find you're in the middle of giving up. Everything. Not really, but that'll do. Bring these guys. Oh no, over to Silesia. So, Nassau. actually work on that to screw him even harder. One heretic prince. Ah, because our land actually got removed from the HRE so it doesn't count. Alright. We'll fix that. Take some of his land. Speaking of which, I want to call that as soon as we can. Danziger's. So I was assuming in this campaign that we could become Germany at some point, but apparently not. Austrian culture is too different, so we'll do that when we play as Bavaria in another campaign later on. Probably months away, who knows. Let's go to Amiri. Peace out Salzburg for whatever. Um, you know what? He's been annoying. We don't care about the number of princes anymore, so we just take his property soon. What is the war score cost of this? 92. So I know what I want from them. Since we can't eat them all while we're taking Salzburg and Koran Danzig, give something a little more annoying to them. Local nobility. Sure. Get some more income from our vassals. It's totally necessary at the moment. It's about 40 in the war. Alright, tax down again. Apparently we are refunding people's tax and still making money. Right, 
Stop touching that. They're fine. Alright, so we're waiting for Diplo. How much Diplo will we actually need for what I want to do to Saxony? 276. And we would also want Salzburg. Yeah, that costs too much. We just take his capital away when we vassalize him. Don't really want to let Salzburg live though. So, hey Salzburg. Oh, they took Myland. That's just rude. They're gonna be like that. Go down there and sort them out. Alright, so Salzburg. Will be integrated because reasons, I've already said. They're annoying being in the middle of our country like that, so take that first. And immediately core it. No. Then we gotta wait for whatever it was, 200 and something. Austrian vassal, 276. And we're going to take Actually, does this change the points? It does. All right. Take both our claims. Then we get aggressive expansion with the Germans, but it's less diplo power needed. Uh, no. All right, well, I'm going to take, take a short break here. When we come back, we will destroy the Emperor for stealing the Empire from us and probably finish this bit and go to war with Silesia. So... Thanks for watching, I'll see you again soon.